Microsoft just hiked their office prices by 30%. <clears throat> Perfect timing to compare their email overlord against the scrappy underdog that nobody talks about, Thunderbird. Here's what's absolutely nuclear about this comparison. Microsoft charges you $130 yearly for their family plan, which includes Outlook. Thunderbird costs $0.00 forever. So before you think this is David versus Goliath, let me break down what you actually get for that price difference. Thunderbird Supernova just dropped, and it's genuinely impressive. Mozilla rebuilt their entire interface from scratch. The new design looks modern without trying too hard, and performance improvements are legitimately noticeable. The privacy features are where Thunderbird gets criminally underrated. External content gets blocked by default, tracking protection runs automatically, and Mozilla doesn't harvest your data for advertising revenue. But here's where reality hits. Outlook integrates seamlessly with Microsoft's ecosystem. If you're already paying for Office applications, the email client becomes essentially free. Calendar scheduling works flawlessly, Teams integration is built in, and Exchange server compatibility is perfect. Thunderbird struggles with modern workplace demands. Exchange integration exists but feels clunky. Mobile apps are basically non-existent, so you're stuck using your phone's default client. Calendar functionality works but lacks the polish of Outlook's scheduling features. However, Thunderbird excels at what email clients should prioritize. Customization options are extended through add-ons, multiple account management handles different providers beautifully. Local storage means your emails aren't held hostage by subscription services. The real decision comes down to workflow integration versus independence. If your life revolves around Microsoft services, switching to Thunderbird creates friction without significant benefits. But if you value privacy, cost savings, and don't need enterprise features, Thunderbird offers legitimate competition. The verdict depends entirely on your use case. Try Thunderbird Supernova for two weeks. If you find yourself missing Outlook features you actually use, the subscription cost becomes justified. If basic email functionality satisfies your needs, you just save yourself over $1,000 across the next decade.